Okay, now we know the point in time. Do we? Come on, we don't have any time to lose. Then please, no opera. What's an opera? Oh, I'll explain later. And now, full speed ahead! Ah! They're distracted. Good thing. Fupnicks! That was demeaning. And now he's gone and stolen our Omux as well. We are stuck here! No problem. I've got a plan. Can you see that thing there? I think it's some kind of Nyx pox. And they use this sort of foofnu here, do they? They won't get far if I activate it. Sooner or later, they will be forced to come back here. Are you sure? Who knows how often we have done this already? Not often enough, obviously. Otherwise, they would have brought our Omax back long ago. Hmm. Sounds logical. But how do we use that machine? Well, I think we just need to turn that crank. No, stop! Completely wrong! Rufus, don't! That's him! That's him! Have you brought our Umux back? The time pod? Not directly. Then I'm just going to have to crank again. Aha! Uh -huh. So it was you all the time. You have to stop! You don't know the chaos you're causing! Who are you anyway? We come from the future. We are from Utox. In your language, Utopia. Utopia? As in, the utopia that the Elysians wanted to reach by blowing up Deponia? That plan was doomed to failure. Because we're gonna stop it. Yes, you will. But your people will manage to reach us one day. It has been preordained. At least it used to be. We just wanted to sniff a bit of historical air. Just observing. Not interfering. But when we returned to our time, there was no Utox anymore. The spaceship that you call Elysium had launched and had crashed into our planet, killing everybody. That's why we returned, to fix the cause. We wanted to re-establish the original timeline. But then you stole our Umox, compromising the whole space-time continuum. Everything must remain just how it once happened. It is obvious that this timeline here is already too damaged. We have to use your Nyx box so you can return our Umux to us. No, no, no. You can't just put everything back the way it was at the start now. You have no idea what it took to even get this far. Even if it takes as Zizzy Arden goes, you're bound to manage it sometime. Keep back. I am going to activate the Nyx box now. Y uh, okay, I give up. But, uh, let me do that. You'll just break it. Hmm. Very well. But just you dare to take us for a ride on your tusks. Then your girlfriend will be reduced to Moxo Poxo. Moxo Poxo. Anything but that. What are you up to? Don't panic. I know what I'm doing. Piece of crap. Huh? What's this? A secret compartment for spare parts? <gasps> That's impossible! Hopefully it will have the desired effect. So, done! At last. Now everything will remain... The way it happened before. Exactly. Watch out! Where are we? No time to explain. We have to hurry. Come on. We can still catch it. Catch? What? Catch what? Catch why? Come on!
And now, full speed ahead! Ah! Oops, I guess that was reverse. Please be careful. My motion sickness. Is... Yeah, yeah. Relax while you hold on tight! Ah! Ow! Oh, great. What now? I think we've bought ourselves a little time. Now, if no more major accidents happen, then... Rufus! Rufus, say something! Holy Hugo! Rufus, everything okay? <laughs> Micronicle. Look, Gull, it's Micronicle. Who is Gull? And what are you doing here in the middle of the road? You were going to set the elephant trap up. Yeah, but then everything turned out differently. We stole the Utopian's time pod and accidentally wiped out the future of the universe. W wait a minute. What? No future? Well, except maybe for the one where everyone is dead and Deponia is overrun by Fulox. No idea how that happened. Oh, no! I am a monster! Why didn't I listen to my father and study something sensible? Well, I'm stumped. Might have been better. For all of us. You are so right. You are so right. Forgive me, Father! Maybe we were a little hard on him. Huh? I'm with you on that. I'm gonna miss him. It can just stay right there, in the ditch of history. Ah, there you are. You don't need to worry anymore. It's all taken care of. Oh, who are you? Fufnix, he's seen us! Don't panic, we're time travelers too. I stole your time pod and accidentally wiped out the future. Uh, I beg your pardon? Then you created a time loop to lure me back here. But now, it's all taken care of. You just have to be careful when you enter interim time. It's swarming with Fulox. Whereby they can't regroup once the future is reopened. Obviously true. Perhaps you are right and we've managed it this time. It's a big load of schnaffa foe to me. What are Fulox anyway? Uh, long story. We'd be happy to tell you the whole thing on the way. And it would be so kind of you to drop us off somewhere, so we can't interfere with anything. Just be too stupid if we were to accidentally trigger another Armageddon. <laughs> uh-huh. Very well. And are you sure that everything has been returned back to normal? Well, this time travel business is pretty complicated. But yeah, I think everything's fine now. Hey, you! Stop making so much noise! I worked all day on my balloon and... What the junk is going on here? Okay, no one move a muscle. This is an outrage! I want to know what is going on here immediately. And I want to know what you plan to do with us. Well, fair enough. Luckily, we had a Shinshuma Klux with us, which enabled us to fernungle your Shinshumas. What? Nobody fernungles my Shinshumas! It's not what you think. Is this about eradicating memories? Okay, it is what you think. It's not what I thought. What about you? Well, I was thinking about an ocelot. <laughs> Ocelots are really funny. <laughs> yeah. Quiet! If one of you two is not happy with this idea, then so much the better, because only one of you can be fernungled anyway. He will then have the honor of rescuing Deponia together with gold. I choose Rufus. Great! Great. Not you. We're talking about the other goal, who is still on Elysium at this point in time. What? But what's going to happen to me? You are going to be Busak, just like the spare Rufus. Will you please stop with your miserable you talk schmoo talks? I think the correct expression in your language is iced. What? what? Uh, just wait a minute. <laughs> what did you think? You don't belong in this time. The risk that you'll get involved again is just too great. So, you have a choice. One of you is going to have their memories wiped, and will need to do everything again. Oh, no. Everything? All over again? Not me. The other one and goal will be iced. That doesn't sound very tempting, either. Not high on my list, either. Just decide amongst you 
whilst Kugo looks for a suitable fuse. Is there no other solution? No. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, you idiot. You knocked over the Shinshuma clocks. Oops. What a foof next. No false moves, understood? I can't talk to him out loud. Otherwise, I'll blow his cover. Luckily, we're an experienced team and understand one another without words. Hey, Tuck, can you hear me? Loud and clear! Mm, then the training paid off! I learned from the best, sir, Rufus, sir. Oh, come on, you're embarrassing me. One, sir, is more than enough. Yes, sir. Now for my plan! You have to overpower the Utopians! Uh, difficult. Luckily, I know exactly what to do. As soon as I break cover, there is no turning back. You can do it, Tuck! I'm just waiting for your command. Okay, on my command. If I don't make it, just leave me behind. You can do it, Tuck. It was an honor to have served with you, sir. And... go! Abort! Abort! I have no clear line of fire! Okay, I'll take care of it. Just wait for the signal. I have understood everything and will do exactly what you expect of me, sir. Right. Fits. That's fortuitous, for I finally found the fuse. Well done, Kugo. Ha! Now it's all back in place again. Which one of you is having the brain wipe? Uh, we need more time to think. This isn't a decision you make every day. You have to weigh all the pros and cons. Do you maybe have a flip chart? Enough of this, Buffnox. I'll choose you. What? Why me? Because you are obviously the class Schmogo here. <laughs> Don't attempt to fight it. It will make the pain easier to bear. We will begin as soon as the Shinshuma Clux is fully charged. Now! What's that meant to be? An epileptic fit? Can't you hear me? Now! Don't think for a minute that your limited pantomime skills will be able to alter a single thing. Damn it, Tuck! That was the signal! What kind of signal? When I do this, it means now! Hey, Rolex! There's another one there! Now what? Never mind now! We'll take care of him in a minute! It means throw now! Now! And... energy! Throw already! Throw! Too late! Well, you know the rest of the story, don't you? With no memories of his adventures the other side of time, Rufus tried everything in the book to get back to Elysium. 
That's how he eventually got to know me. He rescued me from the claws of the Organon, tried to return me to Elysium, and together we finally saved Deponia from certain destruction. In the end, though, he let go. And he fell. Until suddenly... Did someone here order a taxi? Go? Don't tell me you need some kind of special invitation. Come on, take my hand, quick! Wait. You don't know this bit yet, do you? Hurry! <laughs> ah! Got you! Go! I just can't... Is it really you? Or am I already dead? You were going to be going to be dead. I couldn't allow that to happen. Huh, but cutting your hair off is okay. Now, shut up and help me pull you up. Stop this instant. Let the man go. Everything must remain how it has already happened once before. Who the heck are you? That's none of your concern. The only important thing is that you understand the consequences here. If you let him fall, then we will return you back to your time. But if you refuse, then I will be forced to cut the rope. So for the last time, let him go! Who or what the hell is that? Haven't a clue, but I'm sure they're just bluffing. You're just bluffing! You wouldn't allow me to fall to my death. I will pull him up, whether you like it or not. Are you sure that's such a good idea? Quite sure. Right, let's be having you. Hupsy daisy! <laughs> gotcha. I've done it. Looks like we're quits then. This time, I saved you. Yeah, looks like you did. Unfortunately, there's kind of a snag. Why? Well, they were not bluffing. Huh? What the? Hey, we're alive. The rear thrusters must have slowed the fall. Hear that, Goal? We're alive. We're... Goal? Goal? Oh, no. Not that. Goal! Goal! Uh -oh. Chill box batteries depleted. Danger! Danger! Consume food or replace batteries. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, oh, what? What's going on? Not sure. Don't think we're dead, though. <laughs> I'm rather glad those Utopians meant iced when they said iced. Warning! Warning! Plasma explosion detected distance 512 clicks. Thermonuclear chain reactions will spread across the planet. Structural integrity of scrap crust will fail in one minute. Warning, warning, your provisions are in danger of defrosting. Wait a minute. The world is going to end in one minute? And me, being the idiot I am, forgot to cancel the post. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, please, no. Is there no other way? I don't see any. We won't remember anything, right? That won't change the fact that it was a great time. Yes, it certainly has been. So long, Rufus. It was an honor, Goal. Oh. 
What a nightmare. I was old and had a mustache. All my friends were dead, and the Lysium had fallen from the sky. Also, I blew the pony out. God, talk about sick. I mean, a mustache? Really? Ah, luckily, everything's the way it was before. I can hardly wait to tell my sweet pony about it. Bubble wrap from... What was I gonna... Eh, whatever. I'll just leave it here until I remember what I wanted it for. Sweet! The balloon filled with gas while I slept. Now, all I have to do is adjust the flame, and then it's to Elysium and beyond! Tony won't believe her eyes. <laughs> I better get her crystal glasses back. Not that anything would happen to them. Time to get to work. No, stop! This seems vaguely familiar somehow. That's exactly the way things happened in my dream. I had forgotten the bubble wrap. And that's when everything went to pieces. Tony was so angry that we broke up. And then I uncovered an organ on conspiracy and started a revolution? Well, note to self, stay away from sampling the adhesives before bed. These visions aren't all bad. I should become a prophet. Nina, Nina, let me through. I'm a prophet. <laughs> huh? Hey, stop! You can't park here. You. Oh boy. Somehow my vision missed this. Wait, wait, wait. You don't want to seriously tell the whole story from the beginning again. Do you? But that's the point. Now that I cut out the power inverter in that thought thingy, I can remember everything. Wait, I'm confused. Didn't you just say you had missed? So I did, you blockhead. Each and every one of the thousands of times I can now remember. But I finally hit it. Hey, didn't you see the awesome special effects? Why do you think I look so old, eh? I, I, I was distracted. The power inverter inverted the effect of the, 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 the shishu, whatever. Shinshuma clocks. Uh, 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 memory laser. Instead of forgetting, I now remember everything. Memories of over 100 years of the same old story. You think your skin would hold out any better? Oh, it's just a trick. Nothing more than a phony magic trick. Do I look like I use trickery? I got gout, young fella. We completely underestimated the problem. We aren't dealing with just one loop. The time loop you created with the Chronicar was only a small loop within a much larger one. And that larger loop has two loops of its own, one of which has a lot more loops. The big loop only starts again at the end of the second loop. What is that old fool driveling on about? I think I know what he means. It's like a pizza box that you fold in the middle and then take a pen and... No, not like a pizza box. It's actually quite simple, but just complicated. All this has already happened countless times, too often to count. And if you laser me again this time, it's just going to repeat over and over. Goal and I will save Deponia. I'll fall. She'll try to catch me. You'll cut the cable. Goal will die. I'll blow the world to smithereens. Goal and I will thaw and crank back time. Then everything is back to the beginning, and I'll meet one Mc 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 thingy Mc Mc what's his name. Steal the time pod, save future goal from the future, jump off Elysium, and after we've chased across half the planet and through all the different times, we'll end up sitting here in the end again. The only difference, this time I managed a hit with the power inverter, and that's why I know... <sighs> This is our only chance to break the cycle. Oh, yes? 
And just how are you gonna do that? You look like you couldn't even bite through a cracker. Yeah, there's more wind in these old lungs than you have in your entire lard butt, Greenhorn. I have a plan. First, we need to erase his memory. What? But... After all, someone has to make sure that Deponia is saved. As soon as he's back to sleeping, unaware, in the balloon again, the time will be right for another brilliant Rufus maneuver. Oh, great. You got any more bright ideas? Huh? Who are you? Someone who is going to rip you a new Oboff. You have completely and utterly destroyed our Umak. And the time loop is still there, just as before. So, somewhere in the far future, everything is repeating itself. Again and again. Well, that's wishful thinking. As we haven't iced you, no one will be able to turn back time this time. The old Rufus is going to blow up Deponia. And that will be it. Oh. Well, at least it isn't the same stupid ending as before. Right? Haha. <laughs> mm. uh, don't rejoice too soon. Rufus? What now? Another one of them? Which Rufus are you? I am the Rufus you left behind on Elysium, you idiots. That's impossible. We eliminated you before we took care of future goal. You tried to kill him. Of course. Otherwise, he would have stopped the other goal. But you didn't mention anything about that. They only know half the story. For crying out loud. Hey, who's there? Room service, okay? Uh, uh huh. Something is different, but I can't quite put my finger on it. It's the famous elephant in the room. Ah, did you really think that you could simply steal our Umux just like that? Well, you thought wrong. You don't belong in this timeline. We will have to remove you. Oh, yeah? You'll have to catch me first. Hey! Stop! I said, just stop! You can't escape your destiny! Even if it's kind of terribly heavy costume on and consequently gets out of breath easily. Oh yeah? We'll see about that. Right. Now you're done for. Let's move. Let's move. Hide quickly! There's a wild elephant running around out there! I know! He's right behind me! Oh no! Hold me, Tanner! As long as we have love, we've got nothing to fear, Henna, darling. Blech. Let's move! Now we're going to get you! Time to get out of here. Huh? What now? Some kind of immobilizer? There's not much of a select. Apparently, there's just one single portal within reach. Nah. Nope. Always time to get out of here. Huh? What now? Some kind of immobilizer? Time to get out of here. Huh? Some kind of
Hey, this looks exactly like the first menu. Interesting. <laughs> I knew I could do it without the instruction manual. Hey, stop! Where are you going? I'm not telling. What? This isn't the interim. I must have passed straight through a second portal. Oh, will you look at that? This is Gold's childhood. Stop making such a noise down there, little lady. As you know, disobedience leads to chaos. Chaos leads to garbage. And garbage leads to Deponia. He has just disqualified himself from ever taking his hypothetical grandson for the weekend. Hey, the Telly Buddies! That was my favorite series until they changed Stinky Winky's voice. I cried and threw my porridge around for an entire week. But last Monday, I was finally over it. Goal seems to like it too. I hope she's sitting close enough to see everything. Well, what do you know? There's a space here, but it's empty. Goochie goo! Which good little baby gives Uncle Rufus their tasty lollipop? Pinky Winky! Yeah, almost right. Let's see what a prime controller eats for lunch. How exciting! I packed you something healthy for a change. All that candy will ruin your teeth in the long run. Huh, I can understand some of his bitterness now. Don't thank me for that. <laughs> what? Do you, but you, you have... Boopa, boopa, boopa. Are you kidding me? Surprise! Did you really think that you would be able to hide from us here? Well, you thought wrong. And now, it's my turn to seek, right? No. Wrong again. It's your turn to be eliminated. And may Zorfix have mercy if you have changed anything here. <laughs> The portal that they had opened under my feet led into the interim. Ah! There, I was caught in the middle of a huge junk avalanche that dragged me into the depths. As if an entire city were to slide into the gaping jaws of hell. Paradox City. The whole place must have slipped down when the future opened up underneath it. Yes, but this timeline also came to an end. After an eternity in freefall, I finally landed there. My last thought was, if only I had a weapon with which I could open portals. Maybe I could have used it to slow my fall. That doesn't explain how you got onto our back seat. No, it doesn't. I wanted to build a little tension. I assume that this whole thing has happened like this thousands of times. And every time, I came to on Elysium and had forgotten everything, almost everything, because the sequences gradually became more and more familiar. For crime. Hey, who's there? Room service, okay? Uh, uh huh. How long does he want to. No. I think I have deja vu. Something is wrong here, but I can't quite put my finger on it. It's the famous elephant in the room. Ah! Did you really think that you could... Hey! Stop! Got milk? Check. That's all I could get.
time to get out of here. Huh? Some kind of... I could do it without the instruction manual. Hey, stop! Where are you going? I'm not telling. Gucci goo, which good? Thank you. And. Oh. Thank me for that. M -m 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 Where am I? <laughs> oh, there I am. Behind you. Oh. <laughs> Children are so stupid. Perishable milk stashed in a secret space? Check. <laughs> Surprise! Did you really think that you would be able to hide from us here? Well, you thought wrong. And now, it's my turn to seek, right? No. Wrong again. It's your turn to be eliminated. And may Zorfix have For crying out loud. Hey, room, sir. Uh... I think I have deja vu. Something is, but I. It's that. Ah! De... Hey, stop! Got milk? Check. That's all I could get. A bottle full of <laughs> cheese. That's why it stinks so badly in here. Actually, I wanted to leave it here. On the other hand, and as long as I'm careful... Whoops! Smiling at me doesn't matter. Gut feeling is gut feeling. Yeah. I've duplicated cooler things, like myself, for example. Why does the word tachyon spring to mind? That's just gibberish, like Rococo or foot hygiene. Mmm, clock hands as ammunition. Something is ringing a bell. And... It doesn't seem to make it, but I have the. It doesn't seem to make it, but I... as if a sleight of hand. I don't know what I, but it looks. Yikes! I've got you at last. <laughs> For crying, hey, rooms. It doesn't seem to me, but I have. As if a sleight of hand repeated umpteen thousand times 
was slowly rubbing its way into my consciousness. I think I have deja vu something, but I can't stop. Ah! Hey! Stop! Got milk? Check. That's all I... Actually, on end. Whoops! So many. Why do I have this? All I need and a bottle. Why did that like or? Mm. Something is. Don't know, but it. As you can see, hey, I can off it wherever I steady. Ha, who's the man? Somehow. <laughs> That's a waste of time. It's impossible to survive a fall like that. He was smashed to pieces on the ground. Talking about ground? What's happened to the future? There shouldn't be any ground here. What could we have overlooked? We'll have to go back again. But first, let's check around that corner there. Very well. Better safe than sorry. Well, look at that. It's our Umux. Someone else is trying to interfere with the course of history. Anything very easy for us. Come on. I've got an idea. This time I really broke every bone in my body. I guess it's about time. The pain. I think I'm gonna pass out. With the last of my strength, I crawled onto the back seat and hid under a blanket in the storage compartment. And then I lost consciousness. And now you are stuck here too. Well done. Is the bit where we realize what use this is to us going to come now? I... I think I understand. You were already in Cuba when we got rid of McChronicle, but you were also there, exactly the same, when we didn't do that. No matter which time loop we're talking about, Rufus is sitting in the back seat, here. Hello. As well as in the other timeline, when McChronicle got to Cuba. You mean he was also cowering on the back seat when Rufus and McChronicle stole the time pod? And now, full speed ahead! Whoa! Oops, guess that was reverse.
as well as during your side trip to future Elysium's ruins. Exactly. Uh, there's a fire extinguisher in the storage compartment behind you. Could you please? Uh, all right. Um, I think you're... Mm, that doesn't matter. It'll work. <laughs> a fire extinguisher is a fire extinguisher, right? He was there when you brought Future Goal to Elysium. Oh, that, that, that was a uh, piercing, was it? Change the subject, okay? Uh, if we have to. What's our next move? And disappeared with her into interim time. Wicked. But that means... Did someone here order a taxi? Go? Don't tell me you need some kind of special invitation. Come on, take my hand, quick! No, wait! Yikes! Well, peekaboo, surprise! <laughs> Rufus? But how on earth did you get there? It's a long story, which we don't really have time for, right? Right. I want to keep you from... Oh, look, Barry! Hello, Rufus! Now, I want to keep you from making a big mistake. Whatever you're up to, it won't turn out well. Oh, you think so? Then just you watch. Rufus, your hand, now! No, stop! Hurry, what are you waiting for? Whoa! Got you! Goal, I just can't believe it. How can you be here? And who is he? Well, I'm here to save you. But who knows what he's doing here? Then let me explain. I'm here to warn you. About what? That you've gained weight? A postcard would have been enough. Uh. I want to stop you from ruining the ending. Oh, just shut up, will you? Both of you, just shut up and help me get you in here. Stop this instant. Let the man go. Actually, the men. Everything must remain how it has already happened once before. Who the heck are you? That's none of your concern. The only important thing is that you understand the consequences here. If you let them fall, then we'll return you to your time. But if you refuse, then I will be forced to cut the rope. Now for the last time, let them go! Who or what the hell is that? Haven't a clue, but I'm sure they're just bluffing. No, they're not. Goal! You know me! I'm the Rufus who saved you from your future, but that future no longer exists! That is the whole point of this! Now you don't understand! Somehow, we've fallen into a time loop! We have to break the cycle! Future? What's all this talk about the future? Let's just assume that you are right. Do you have a plan to get us out of this almighty mess? Uh, of course I have a plan! Then spit it out! There's only one thing you can do. You have to let go. Okay, that seems a bit extreme. But as long as it's part of another brilliant Rufus maneuver, it's all right by me. So, what's your plan? You parked your hoverboard under the next cloud. Or have you got a whistle with which you can summon the eagles? Or, wait a minute, no. You exchanged all of us with holograms, right? Come on. Out with it, I let go and then what? How the heck are you planning to break your fall? Not at all. We won't survive. What? What kind of plan is that? Try to understand. It, it's not about saving him or me here. What? Why? Since when? We're already history. But for you, Goal, there's still a future. I'm sorry for giving you false hope. Both of us. Make it three. I should never have brought you back from your future. I wanted to, to find a better ending. And I came within a hair of ruining everything we achieved. Deponia is now in a time loop. Happy ending? Nothing of the kind. And the ending you're creating here is the worst of all. I didn't want to tell you this, but if you do this, Goal will die. Afraid so. And I... I grow a mustache! No! You're lying! Why are you lying? So, 
There is no hope for us? What's happened has happened and there's no way of reversing it? Nonsense. There is always hope. And you can do all sorts of impossible things. And you definitely should. Tons of them. Several times a day. You can defeat the Organon. Travel to Elysium. Uh, find a practical use for half fashion. And, and pick stars from the heavens. Even the past can be changed, if required. But if you undo all the great impossible things that you have achieved, then you have to do them all over again. Only then, they're no longer quite as impossible, you know? Do you really want to change what you went through together? Destroy the world over and over just to save it again? You fought together for one goal. What are you fighting for if it never ends? <coughs> But this is your moment. The decision is yours. I've said all I can say, and I'm at the end of my strength. Bon voyage. No! No! What a jerk. For sure. Oh, what does he know? There's always a way, right? Come on, just say it. We'll make it. Somehow. I think he was right, Cole. It would be really stupid if everything we've been through had never happened. Could you wrap it up already? And anyway, changing the past? <laughs> That's child's fuff next. We've done far more impossible things. We divided your personality in three. Cloning you? Hello? Shrunk you and put you in Bozo's ear? Huh? When did that happen? Uh, you were asleep at the time. The important thing is, though, that we had a great time together. Yes. I certainly did. Only the most impossible thing of all, I did alone. Let you go. Maybe that's the one thing that we should correct. Let's do it together. But, but, I, I can't do that. Our patience is at an end. We are now going to count to Zucks. Ango, Bongo, Schnicks, Double Schnicks, Clovis. I never had the chance to say goodbye. So goodbye, Rufus. Clovis too. We had such an awesome time. Ubel. Yeah, super awesome. Corklatch. Nasal. Zooks. <laughs> nice. Although, wait a minute. Whoa! <laughs> As I have mentioned before. The end was never our creation. It was there all this time. All we did was tempt it and somehow outmaneuver it once again. Perhaps we're not doing so bad after all. The Utopians took me back to the time when Rufus and McChronicle had picked me up. Of course, I was still grieving, but there was also something new and old. Hope. I've been thinking about the other Rufus a lot. Was there another goal too? I would have liked to have found out more about their adventures. But apart from me and the Utopians, no one knew that they had ever existed. And that above all, everything had not been in vain. They left no trace, except in my memories. Just like the sea.